Hey, it's your boy, King Nace, No Slate, No Chronicles. And it's your boy, Dysfunctional, Dysfunctional's World. I just want to say, it is now time. Can we play the Michael Jordan music, bro? It is bull season. All my Tars is having birthday. With that being said, by request we'll be doing the Pisces, Aries, Cusp Woman, and... A Libra man. No, Le Leo. Leo man. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. What you, uh, you want to start with this one? Uh, go ahead. Dang, you got passing me. Okay, what I know about the Aries Pisces, I learned almost in one night. I didn't know we had two Aries Pisces in one area. Kind of crazy, but they kind of act a little bit different. I can sense a little bit uh, of the same thing. Like maybe they wear the same color lingerie and they agree with each other a lot. I saw them agreeing back and forth. No, I don't with. think so. They was agreeing a lot about what, what they were talking about. They still buy each other sisters, fire sisters, what they call themselves. Even though there was a cut, they just thought they were Aries. Mm. So, uh, I can see them being real honest, real uh, exuberant, outspoken. Exuberant? They, Go ahead. What is exuberant? Like fun and fun. Yeah. Really? You had me second guessing my own. I knew I got my definition no, no, right. No, no, I'm just, yeah, fun. Yeah. They were fun. They were seem real fun and stuff. They seem like they speak their mind. They can be blunt. Um, hmm. And they worry about nothing. They're mm -hmm. not worrisome at all. They just let things kind of go. And uh, also, I seen that they backed each other up. Like they had, I could, I could sense a loyalty in both of them. You know what I'm saying? From them talking and stuff. Like when she said something, and she was like, uh, "Yeah, I'm up." Uh, before she could say it, she, she, her birthday the same birthday as mine. You know what I'm saying? She, she, she would jump in there and stuff. And other girl jump in for her and stuff. And they had each other back. So now you're dealing with the king of the jungle, Mufasa or Scar. So when these, when, these, when these two people meet, we actually had a Leo at the party, too. And I'm trying to picture them two together. Them two will be our examples and stuff. I see it pretty good. They both came in with a different type of swag. It seemed like she was very unique and she accepted. Who's the Leo? The guy with the suit on, with the, uh, the silk. The pajamas. Yeah. The only one that said he liked grapes. He was in with it. Okay, go ahead. Royalty. And he had a swag about him. I could picture them two being together easily. Uh, he seemed like he could take a straightforward woman, which we gave to Leo Aries a good uh, squall, because he could take it and dish it out. And he got something to prove, so he's going to be loyal, and he's going to stay down for it. Why are you saying, go ahead, bro, go ahead, bro. Take me off, then. You're going to take me off my screen. Okay, uh, Aries, Pis Pisces, Aries, Cuss. Mm. They have the affirmation of an Aries with the sensitiveness of a Pisces. They uh, they're, they're like you said, flamboyant and exuberant. Um, they're fun people. Um, they probably vibe better with with Sagittarius and other Aries better than the Leo. But in this in this comparison, <laughs> the Leo, he's not necessarily what they want. But as long as they can feed his ego and allow him to. Act like he's running things. And they can't they'll play that. the game. They won't do that because they're too blunt for that. Their 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 forward forwardness can either be a good or a bad thing, depending on how how it comes out that day. It'll be both because they're gonna um, once hurt their feelings sometimes, and sometimes they're not. Um, they're attractive. They're pretty people. Um, artistic. Um, so when you deal with a person that's artistic, not autistic. Artistic, just make, just make so y'all you know get that up. When you deal with an artistic person, you have to deal with their moods because I think every artistic person has a split personality mm. because they have the person that they present themselves to you because they want you to follow their art. I think the art side will come from the Pisces side. Their their real inner them mm -hmm. is not necessarily that person they project. Well, okay, I'm going to add to this. Okay. I think the thing that really helps this relationship out is the trouble that any Leo will have with a Pisces woman, the fact that they won't just come out and say what the hell they want. It'll be a little guessing game, a little mystery. This Aries, Pisces don't do that. She's going to come to a Leo man and be straight up with her, I mean straight up with him, and he's going to either like it or hate it. Okay. And if he likes it, then they get together and stuff, they both got loyalty in them naturally. So that to make them fight out. Okay. And also, I'm saying the one part that anybody had to worry about, the Aries, no offense to Aries, but that's the one part you're going to have to worry about. And the lion is built to deal with the Aries. Really? Yes. So, Why? Huh? Why? 
Because one thing, okay, one thing is the uh, the Leo. Number one, he can take the fire and stand there. And we said the one thing about the uh, Leo is, I mean, Aries, they need somebody to stand still or come, I mean, stay there when they come back. Because they can blow up and, and get upset and get mad at you. But when they come back, are you still going to be at home waiting on them? Like, you think Leo do that? He, always. Always. So like I said, the one thing we gave him credit for was the fact that they want credit for being the one that can stay there through the fire burn. The brave heart. The lion heart. You know what I'm saying? If he leaves out and then somebody come in and do a better job than him... That's definitely going to kill his pride. And when I say do a better job than him, naturally you think about man, but that can be her mama talking to her instead of him. That can be a friend or somebody like that. I mean, you're king of the jungle, and you allow somebody else to comfort your woman. I guess when I think of the Leo, I'm mm. more or less thinking of the female trait. Mm. And no matter how loyal that line is, if she feels like she's being burned or manipulated or used too much, she'll leave. But it won't happen in this because this Pisces. He's a male. He's a male line. Yeah, but the Pisces Aries would never do that. The I, Pisces Aries gonna be so straight up, so blunt to the point. I only think the only thing that can bash them is the fact that she said something she wasn't supposed to say, but she can't control her mouth sometimes. Okay, so what do you give it? Uh, out of three, three being the best. If they get together, the they're gonna make it. The only thing about it, the Aries Pisces I worry about is the Pisces part, thinking like. This Leo is not in the position of her fantasy or her fairy tale. When we said you got to be in the vicinity of it. But she's going to be straight up like, you're not my type, bye. And it's never going to happen. Or she's going to be like, you might, I want you. The Aries is going to throw out their Pisces and say, okay, what you want? So I got to get this two up. Oh, two out of three. I like this. Three? Well, three being the best, three up, and three down being the worst. I'm going to have to give it one up. And a two down. Ooh, why a two down? What, what's the problem? I just don't see <laughs> the Pisces sensitivity not being triggered and making mm. the Aries part be like the protective personality. I hear you, man. Well, Pisces Aries woman. Pisces and Aries Leo man kick his ass for that conversation. Leo <laughs> man, come holler at me. Pisces Aries women. Come out at me. I'm dead. It's me. I didn't want to say it. Why you doing that? Like, comment, subscribe, press the notification bell so you know we are dropping new videos just for you. With that being said, peace. Peace.